Yo, what's good, everybody? Got another beers with Barton. It is Friday, Friday, uh, September 30th, last day of September. Crazy. 2022, hope everyone's having a great day, had a great week. And uh, anyone that's on the East Coast, especially uh, Florida, hope everyone is safe. Uh, Hurricane Ian, uh, it is just absolutely destroyed, decimated a lot of parts of Florida, so it's crazy. It's actually moving its way up the coast. Um, so here in North Carolina, we're supposed to get the worst of it here about four, four or five o'clock. It's almost four o'clock PM. Uh, we started getting rain last night. Winds picked up for sure. Not crazy, but definitely picked up and I've been raining off and on all day. Um, the rain is starting to pick up. Winds are starting to pick up. You may be able to hear it. Um, I'm sitting in my garage. Usually I'll sit towards the end of my truck and use the tail bed as like uh, my little bar table, but uh, the winds are very strong, it's blowing the uh, water a couple feet inside the garage. Uh, so I moved back, uh, sitting between the two uh, cars. Um, and uh, probably picking up the wind there um, and just relaxing, um, enjoying a little cigar. and a beer and uh yeah we're gonna bat batten down the hatches uh we pulled all of our um like outdoor we have a covered patio so we took all the cushions off the chairs put them inside uh put a tarp over the tv that's out there and uh put all the furniture up to it so and then we uh ratcheted down the uh trampoline on two sides so we're, we're kind of ready um it says it's gonna be 55 to 60 miles per hour uh gust of winds um so we will probably definitely see it. Uh, three to six inches of rain, depending on where you're at in Charlotte. So that's a lot of rain in 24 hours. Um, so we'll see. Uh, but pretty much, like I said, all day it's been raining. The wind is picking up. So Jess went to the grocery store yesterday, got a bunch of stuff. We're going to make homemade pasta sauce tonight. We got soups. Um, I have plenty of beer and bourbon and cigars. So we're just going to hang out. Uh, obviously tonight, uh, school is canceled. Uh, for uh, on the majority of Charlotte, uh, CMS, which is Charlotte Mecklenburg Schools, uh, they're the biggest county. They did an asynchronous, so it's like the kids work by themselves online. But uh, all the other surrounding areas outside of Charlotte, we're in Concord. It's just north of Charlotte. I'm about three miles from that line. Uh, they just canceled school. No makeup, just canceled it. So we've been hanging out today. We had the the air conditioner. I'm sorry, the HVAC, the furnace, gas furnace checked for its PM. Everything's good. Changed the filters. Potter went to doggy daycare for a couple hours, uh, so he's tired. And Jess and I are working. Michaela's been doing homework, uh, FaceTime with friends, and um, doing some chores. So, like I said, it's about four o'clock. Uh, I'm gonna hang out here for a bit um, and take a nice warm shower, and then uh, we're gonna make some dinner, homemade pasta sauce, and uh, watch Hocus. Pocus 2 came out today on Disney, so we're looking forward to it. But again, Hurricane Ian, if we're getting this weather, um, I went to pick up Potter about an hour ago. I dropped him off about 9.30 this morning. Picked him up about an hour ago, and uh, the winds are starting to pick up. Uh, passed a couple trucks, uh, big semis, and you know their, their trailers were moving a little bit, so it's only going to get worse. Uh, didn't see any standing water. We have some low-laying areas, but uh, we're okay there. But Tonight's a great night to stay in, and probably tomorrow's a good day to stay in, too. So uh, we'll just have to see how it plays out. But uh, we haven't lost power. Um, all the devices are charged in case we do. And uh, we have plenty of food and uh, beverages to keep us warm and safe. So hope everyone else is staying safe, especially Florida. Uh, Jessica has a lot of family in Florida. So it means I have family in Florida because we're married. Um, and so far, I think they've got a lot of rain, but they're... They're okay so i think the storm may have passed them enough to where they're not going to get any of the damage severe damage that other parts of florida have gotten so all right well that's where we're at um gonna do a quick beer review tonight as well during this hurricane ian watch um this bad boy noda brewing uh is in uh noda which is basically charlotte and it's a really cool uh, brewery. I like them. So uh, this is a Juicy Imperial IPA. It's an 8.5. It's called Big Slurp. And uh, it just came out a little bit ago, and I was super excited about it. 
was going to try to find it. My buddy Danny Dimes uh, hooked me up because he got a four pack when he found it. Um, I just saw it once last week and he said, not really that good, not a fan. Um, don't buy it. And I was like, okay, you know, I've been on the uh, Oktoberfest and pumpkin beers anyway, so I kind of stayed away. It's like, you know, 13, 14 bucks a uh, four pack, so not crazy, but um, then he had a second one and said, you know, maybe. Maybe it's, you know, growing on me. I don't know, maybe my palate was off that day, whatever, but it's, it, it tastes better today than yesterday. He goes, I'll give you one um, before you buy it. Uh, so he hooked it up. Uh, we're in the same office. We go in a couple days a week. So I saw him on, uh, I think it was Tuesday this week, either Tuesday or Wednesday. And uh, he gave me one along with a Kentucky bourbon, uh, Kentucky barrel-aged bourbon. It's a beer, I can't, KBS. Um, and so I wanted to try it tonight. So I said, again, it's an 8.5. Um, we're going to see if it's a sippa. Easy drinker. Or a sippa. But appreciate the share. Perfect day to try it out. Um, if I like it, the four pack's out. Um, this weekend, they had a bunch of like... Uh, you know, Oktoberfest and new beer releases that are pushed to next week. So they're expecting the weather to be pretty bad. Um, and again, canceling the schools is probably good because right about now, all the kids would be getting on the bus and driving with these winds. No bueno. So again, big slurp. And uh, we're going to pour this bad boy up and we're going to enjoy it. And then we're going to enjoy the cigar. Get ready for the evening and watch a little hocusy, uh, pocusy, which will be fun to do. And... Uh, kind of go from there. That was a good pour. So again, I hope everybody's safe, especially in Florida. Um, my family's safe down there at this point. I think the storm's passed. It's just such a slow moving. It's just big, but it's moving like a couple miles an hour. So it's just sitting on top and just beating up wherever it's at. I think Cuba lost um, the entire island. I don't know how you know big that island is. I mean, it's not huge, but uh, lost all the power. So that that's crazy. A lot of places in Florida have... Um, Looks like my neighbor got Uber Eats. Good for you. Uh, it looks like, um, yeah, a lot of other places have lost power. Um, so hopefully we don't because it'll be an even longer weekend. Um, but like I said, our electronics are pretty much charged up. So worst case, we'll have a couple hours being able to use our uh, um, our devices. And then, uh, you know, we turn on the old trucks and RAV4 and uh, get some power, worst case scenario. But uh that's not a big problem to worry about compared to others. So cheers to Friday. Hopefully everyone's being safe. Hurricane Ian, be nice. Uh, you're kind of being a jerk right now. It's not cool. Uh, <coughs> and uh, <coughs> I hope everyone's kind of um, just kind of hanging out. Uh, if you don't got to go out, it, it's not so much the rain. The rain is, you know, the rain. Um, it really is the, uh, <laughs> the wind is picking up 55 to 60 miles an hour is what they're estimating. So we'll see. All right. It's a big slurp. No dot. See if it's any good. See if it's a sippa. Easy drinker. Or a guzzler. Hurricane would be nice. Cheers to Friday. Cheers to the last day of September. We are in the fourth quarter of 2022. It's crazy. Only three months left. Cheers. Smells good. Fruity. Very juicy. Oh. It's actually really tasty. It's got a little bite at the end. It's 8.5, so kind of be expected, but it's got a really good flavor. It's pretty smooth, actually, for an 8.5, so I don't know. Danny Dimes, I think your second assessment that it's actually grown on you and it's not bad. It's probably a good one, because I like this. Um, like I said, I'm kind of in the uh, Oktoberfest, pumpkin beers, bourbon, barrel A's, and I've been just drinking bourbon lately, too. Less beers, because it's been filling me up. So I'm kind of over the IPAs right now, although I still like them, love them, especially the hazies. But uh, this is pretty tasty, man. Appreciate you sharing it. And uh, yeah, cheers. Wow, it's good. All right. That's probably a easy drink huh? for me. Maybe a sipper. Maybe it's a guzzler. I don't know. All right, everybody, have a good rest of your evening.
Hopefully everyone has been uh, safe today. Probably working from home. I hope if you can, staying safe. All right, that's it. Next time I'm on, it'll be October. Until next time, everybody, Hurricane Ian, be nice, stay safe. Adeuces.